Buffalo Bayou's $55 million makeover is paving the way for recreation right in the heart of the city. Henry Yao reports on this iconic green space. This is not the coolest place to be right now. It's a little dirty. I don't let my dog swim in it. It's, it has been known as a smelly bayou. But the Buffalo Bayou is getting there. I think it's awesome. I think it's uh, going to be ultimately a wonderful experience and, and a really big attraction. From Shepherd to Sabine, bikers and runners will enjoy spruced up new trails, along with shaded structures and seating areas, a dog park, a concert venue, a restored lake, and access to the city's recently discovered water storage cistern. It's all part of the Bayou's $55 million makeover, which is privately funded. We're um, working on revitalizing and transforming Buffalo Bayou into its natural state and really encouraging the recreational components. Well, the Buffalo Bayou is a huge body of water. It's over 50 miles long. It begins in Katy and stretches all the way to the Port of Houston. The idea is to create small different parks, interlock them, and finally create a walking destination in the Bayou City. It's a 20-year visionary master plan sure to beautify and shape the future landscape of our city. I think ultimately they're going to do some really great things down here. In downtown Houston, Henry Yao, 713 News. Thank you, Henry. Buffalo Bayou's first park, the Sabine Promenade, was completed in 2006. It attracts hundreds of visitors each year.